Oakland is in the middle of a crime crisis. In just over 24 hours, three people were shot and killed there. At least two others were shot and wounded. One of the people who was killed was a local DJ known as DJ Peanut. He was shot and run over by a car early Sunday morning. Our Betty you talked with a friend who said he wanted to make Oakland a better place. I just want people to understand that people do care about them. This is just one example of Oakland DJ Peanuts giving spirit, according to his friend who said he drove to Skid Row in L.A. during the pandemic. He bought 500 blankets to donate. Shooting, should I? Early Sunday morning, friends identified him as the young man who was shot right before he was hit by a car on 14th Street in downtown Oakland. The whole, the whole Oakland is terrible right now. One of his closest friends, DJ Butta Smooth, was one block away late Saturday night when shots rang out. Oh, down the street. <laughs> the emotions are still too raw. He said Peanut had been enjoying a fun night out. I'm so sorry. I was down the street, all I heard is gunshots. Literally on the same block. The same block came up here and just told myself, I hope it's not somebody I know. And it was Peanut. He said Peanut had just bought some late night food and was surrounded by friends when he was hit by gunfire. The two spent five days a week together, often performing at events. But a smooth said he taught Peanut how to DJ last year. He just wanted to be great and rich. He had four kids. I mean, I got four kids. I need the money. He motivated me to be a great father. Like, you know, like every time we paid him, he always be like, thank you, cuz diapers and formula. When I heard this, we just Omid Ghani was working at his restaurant, Kamdesh Afghan Cuisine on 14th Street, when he heard gunshots around 2.30 a.m. Everyone inside ran and hid in the back for hours, terrified. Saw people run out on the street. Then when we saw the people run on the street, and we got it to know it is a, actually something is going on, and we ran it too. Oakland police have not released information on a suspect or a motive. But a smooth said beyond his talents, Peanut's positivity reached loved ones and strangers. You know, a lot of people become hopeless. I want them to keep hope, keep faith. What will you miss the most about Peanut? He's passionate for everything, for people. He did a giveaway in L.A., walked away from the giveaway, giving the shoes off his feet. So for some perspective, at this time last year, Oakland police recorded 87 homicides. The city just caught up with that this weekend. And Oakland just committed to spend $2.5 million to make sure that when you call 911, you get a faster response. A recent report found the city is struggling with slow response times and has a lot of vacancies at its dispatch center.